Ooh, hi, counselor. You like those legs? Those nice tan legs? You like them? <gasps> Yesterday, I asked you guys if we could smash 10,000 likes and guess what you guys once again delivered it, okay? You delivered the crap out of it. We reached 16k likes, okay? And I said 10k likes and I'll show you what's in this bad boy right here. All right, you guys ready? You guys ready for this? Let's, let's open it up. Oh, oh, don't look. D don't look, okay? It's crazy. Okay, moving on. Our next like goal, guys, if we could smash 15k likes, okay? We hit we hit 16k last time. Where's my Yandere squad at? If we hit 15k likes, I will go to the park or something and, and act like senpai. I feel like these are mild challenges, but I'll do it. Anyway, there has been a new build of Yandere Simulator with some new bug fixes, okay? And we might also do some mods in this episode, but you know, I, want, I definitely want to check out these bug fixes and also see, you know, just how they are. I don't know if it will count for a whole episode, but that's why we have mods just in case. So we're on the Yandere Simulator WordPress. As always, there's these awesome arts. This one's by Miss Elixir, and it's like the heck, we have like, what's her name? What's her name? Rifle, Rifle Chan? She's like, hmm. Why don't you move? Oh, she moves her eyes. Oh my god. Oh, that's pretty good. It's Info Chan's robots? What? Pretty fat Info Chan. So, the main reason I wanted to play this in the first place is the headmaster will now react when Yandere Chan approaches him holding a severed limb. So, I guess he didn't do it before. Well, he probably didn't do it because, you know, it's close to Halloween time. So, those Halloween decorations are just rolling in now. So, you know, when he sees it, obviously he's not going to think it's an actual severed limb. Well, now he does. Now, the, the headmaster is woke. Hashtag woke. He always makes the wise decisions. We all know this. All right. So, if we're going to be severing limbs here, I guess we'll go to cyborg mode. Since, you know, since this has been updated, I haven't tested this new sound effect. Oh. This is like Star Wars. This is the way of the ninja. <laughs> Oka just got freaking decapitated. Oh, just, it's fine. Happens all the time. <laughs> Everyone goes about their day. That's, that's not right. Is it? All right, let's ninja our way up to the headmaster's office and uh, see what he thinks about Oka's arm. Hey, headmaster. Can I please get a... Hand? <laughs> you mean our exoskeleton suit isn't electric proof? I'm taking my- I'm taking this back. I'm getting my money back. Okay, I think we need to try it without Easter eggs. I think that's probably why this is happening. Alright, so now we're gonna move on to the gardening club since this is where we get the chainsaw or the circular saw. Who loves wood shop? Okay, does a, uh, does a head count as a severed limb? I don't know. So, uh, uh, counselor, just a, a heads up. <laughs> We're holding up a freaking student's head and all these all he has to say is like you look familiar I'm playing the new build aren't I okay? Maybe this doesn't count as a severed limb. I'll leave this with you. Okay, you you take care of that Okay, we tried an arm, but again, we did try it with uh, Easter egg, so I didn't really count that We're gonna go and give it a shot with a leg well, They they sure reacted to it. That's for sure. Dear God. I gotta go try to oh hey hey get back get back <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Okay, all right. I gotta go here Oh, yeah, he reacts to it. Uh, bring me a student's hand. No problem. Bring me a head. <laughs> That's funny. Bring me a leg. Deals off. You're dead. So he likes legs, huh? All right. Let's give him a little surprise. How about that? I know what he orders when he goes to KFC or El Pollo Loco. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, Musume, you're flexible. Woo! Ooh, hi, counselor. You like those legs? Those nice tan legs? You like them? They like the way I twist them like this, huh? Huh, big boy? Oh no, he shot right through Musume! <laughs> I kind of wanted to see if that would work. I didn't know what I was expecting. So another really cool thing that I've always wanted to try that I just thought this looked so freaking funny and it would be really fun to mess with. Um, the YouTuber Yandere Mickey, uh, they actually make uh, mods and stuff like that and we've done, you know, we've played some of their mods in the past. But they did this video, How It Feels To Be Jumped. And basically, you can use the pose mod, the KGFTBZ pose mod, to basically duplicate the Saki Mind Slaves. And every single one of them will attack a student. And it's it's really funny to look at. Uh, I'll link the original video down below, but uh, I want to try it. What the heck? Again? What is this? Now what is this? Why is this? Uh, why is this hair here? We found another secret. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we know that that's the directional mic. We seen that last episode, right? Now at least we know it's a directional mic. Now I don't know if that bar has anything to do with it. 
I think that's what we call it. It's probably a directional mic bar. Um, I think uh, Yandere Dev is like implementing it, but why do we have this hair now? What does this mean? And we have the music again. All right, so this is actually using the newer builds. Is, is this like an Easter egg to use something else or something? I, I don't I don't really know. Okay, so actually everyone's still boys, so I totally forgot. I have to change the back. They, they act all stupid if I don't change the back. I mean, just look at Riku or Coconut. I don't know. Back at it again with them dancing skills. What, where did my hair go? <laughs> no, thank you. If you guys have any, like, comments... Or theories on what this hair means. Is it from some anime that I don't know of? Is it a crush crush hair? I cannot, I, I can't tell you if I tried, so yeah, let me know. Let me know if you know, because I want to know. All right, so we're just going to make a few mind slaves. Just a few. I don't know what is going to happen. Well, I mean, I, would, I, did, I didn't think this would happen again, but here I am once again. Exposing Yandere Simulator 3. Oh, we don't know any we don't know any student information. Wait, can we duplicate Senpai? I've never actually messed with this before. Oh no, it doesn't. It does not work. No, it does not want us to do Oh my god, never mind. There's the Oh my god. There's a few Senpai. <laughs> I don't know if it reacts the same or what, but we have lots of Senpais now. And they all seem to have the aura. Wait, so what are they gonna do? Are they all gonna go to the fountain? I mean, I don't think any of them can move. Except for this one, the last senpai standing. <laughs> this is just a messed up version of Yandere Simulator. I, I tell you what, let's have them, well, who should we have, uh, you know, kill? Will they all go towards her at once? Let's try, okay. Oh my god. Okay, we can do herself now. Let's do coconut. What? What? <laughs> Hey, there's no girl there. Oh, is it because Koken is Riku? Oh my, I don't know what we've done. We've done screwed everything up. Oh my god. Can we have an army? I think we can have an army of them. Oh, <gasps> this is pretty cool. I think this might actually work. Okay, we got to try this on a build that's not freaking screwed up. Okay, let's try this on another build. I, that one I've messed up way too much. Okay, so we activated the pose mod on an older build, so I don't know what it's gonna look like. I don't even know if that same issue is gonna happen again, where we're all crazy and we have the directional mic. So let's go and try it out. And uh, this this one, we're gonna try to get an army of Saki mind slaves to take out every single student at once. So I want to see how that's gonna go. It seems like that's kind of how it would work, but I don't really know. Yeah, yeah. Still broken. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but something about the pose mod breaks the game. I don't know if this is Yandere Dev saying, hey, I don't want people using the pose mod anymore. That's not the original pose mod. The only reason I like using the KGFTBZ pose mod um, is because there's like a lot of stuff you can do with it. Like really, like flying and stuff. It's pretty cool. But I don't know. I don't know. Maybe that's not, maybe it's just interfering with his files. I don't really understand it. Saki? This isn't funny. Oh my god, I didn't realize how many were stacked up on me. Look at them go. So many twirls. Have you seen so many twirls before? It's beautiful. I really hope this works. This is gonna be amazing. I just really, I don't think I like all this negativity surrounding me right now. It's just, it's a little toxic. It's just like, I just don't know what to do. Okay, so it didn't work like I wanted it to. For some reason, I wasn't able to give them all knives. I, what's the, what's the deal, huh? What's the deal? Why can't I do that? It would really help if we can walk around normally. That would help. We're gonna try this reverse style, okay? And uh, do it the, the way that uh, Yandere Miki did. And just give her the knife. You're not going anywhere, Saki. We're gonna duplicate you a few times, okay? We're gonna create towers of Saki. Holy crap. Woo! Oh my god, look at that tower! Oh, <laughs> oh it's amazing! It's like the seventh wonder of the, the eighth wonder of the world. All I can say, Coconut, is you should pro probably run. It would be, <laughs> oh my god, that looks like zombies. It would be why it would be a wise decision to run. Well, don't say I didn't tell tell you so. I, I definitely told you so. Oh my god, <laughs> it's a mosh pit up in here. Look at her. <laughs> yeah, she's getting jumped. All right, Coconut, I'm so sorry. <laughs> You know, I've done some messed up things to you in the past, but even you don't deserve something like this. Ah! <laughs> is it messed up that I want to make more? The, the game is running smooth as butter, though, surprisingly. Pretty nice. I'll save you, Coconut, I, I guess. Even though I'm the one that caused it. <laughs> oh, it's too bad that we can't, like, edit or, you know, transform the, the headmaster. That would be even cooler. I, I got another good one for you guys. What if we create an army of Saki mind slaves, but also an army of coconuts? Will they fight? <laughs> are they gonna throw down? What are they gonna do? Oh, this is gonna be good. 
It's gonna be real good. First of all, let's start by creating, uh, we'll just start by creating the, the coconuts first because I feel like that would be a lot easier. All right, so here we go. We got lots of them. Are they all, I bet you they'd all take calls at the same time too. God, look at it. They like drop from the sky. It's like PUBG with, with <laughs> Sakis. Okay, I, I didn't count how many coconuts we made, so we're just gonna have to take a guess of what's about to happen. <laughs> I like how they're- I like how they all go to the same place. I would- I would love to see them all take a call at the same time. We have to try that. Wait, I kind of want to spawn her on the roof just to see what would happen. Oh no, just one. This is a weird episode, ain't it? Okay, is it happening? No, they're just going- What? <laughs> what the- They're all still going after the same one! <laughs> Wait, what happens if I duplicate her now? Okay, I've made more, but I don't know if it's done anything. This is like coconutception. What's up with their hair? They're they're reacting to themselves. Yeah, let's just ignore the fact that there's a bunch of clones of everyone. What's wrong with you? Oh, but we can target someone else. <gasps> She's getting up. Oh my god, they come back from the dead too. Oh, within what? That was that's weird. It's kind of scary if you think about it. It just froze up. Uh, we have to try to get coconut to duplicate her call to like I don't know. Just, just make a bunch of calls or something. And then we can even, <laughs> we can even have some more fun and put some, uh, you know, weights in the buckets. Oh, that would be funny. Yeah, this is normal. <laughs> it's completely normal to do this. Who keeps stealing my hair? Okay, we got a bunch of them. We got a bunch of them right here. Well, um, that sure didn't work. So if that doesn't work, then maybe we could try something else. How about we make Yandere Dev's worst nightmare? How about that? I'm so sorry, Yandere Dev. <laughs> They're all like simultaneously just sending emails. Wait, are they all gonna go to the same class? Are you guys, are you guys ridiculous? It's like St. Patrick's Day over here. Okay, guys, that's pretty much all the time I have for today. Today's scrub of the day is Asriel Killer Killer. I want to go. Hey, quick thing. I sub and like. Oh, and cute quote. If every Yandere was perfect, we wouldn't have you. That's adorable. Thank you so much. That really means a lot to me. It really does. Make sure you tell that to your fellow Yandere, okay? Your, fel your fellow neighborhood Yandere. If you guys want to be scrubbing the day, be sure to drop a like on this video. And don't forget, guys, if we hit if we hit the 15k likes, I'll do the thing that I said I was going to do, okay? I would like to do more stuff like this with the Pokemon. Uh, I feel like I'm opening up a whole new world. So, yeah, maybe next episode we'll mess around with some stuff. So, be sure to leave your suggestions down below. Anyway, I'm Beat You, Mike, and I'll see you scrubs in the next one. Bye, guys.